Hey everybody, Dr. JJ Levine, President of Asante Organics, with today's Mentorship Minute. So today what I'd love to talk about is short-term versus long-term goals. Should you have one? Should you have the other? Should you have both? And I would submit to you that you definitely want both. So why? You have to have short-term goals and you have to reward yourself for having those short-term goals because these are goals that you can achieve on a daily basis, weekly basis, monthly basis, so on and so forth. But then what about long-term goals? The short-term goals are gonna help you get to the long-term goals and you have to have long-term goals. And in some cases, they have to be big, lofty, audacious goals. You have to keep reaching for the stars. You must have long-term goals because that's what's going to keep you from getting frustrated by short-term failures. You're all, we are all going to have short-term failures. We're all gonna have that, good, bad, and different days. I've talked about this before. But by reviewing on a daily basis, twice a day, your long-term goals, that's going to keep you focused. It's gonna keep you centered. It's gonna keep you happy. And as I mentioned before, it's gonna keep you from getting frustrated about any short-term failures or bad days or negative days that come about. So I've mentioned this before in another series, but just as a review, I always recommend some old school three by five index cards. And you can write right on those index cards some of your short-term goals. And then on other cards, your long-term goals, but also visualization that you're already living those long-term goals, whatever they might be, whatever you might create, whatever you might desire, want, whatever the purpose is, fill out a bunch of those cards. And I'd like you to read them every single night right before you go to bed. So you're ready to go to bed. You've, you've got the, 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 the covers, the sheets, the pillow, all the way you like it. It's all peeled back. You've brushed your teeth. You're ready to go to sleep. And you go ahead and read those goals, those visions aloud. And then you go to sleep and allow your subconscious to work on that. You allow yourself to dream about those goals and those visions. And then when you wake up in the morning, first thing that you read those again, twice a day. Very, very simple exercise. Should take you literally two minutes out of your day, especially if you count the morning and the evening. And that's my answer for you. Short-term goals, very, very important. Long-term goals, very, very important. Read them every day, review them every day, refine them every day, and reward yourself as you reach those short as well as those long-term goals. So again, Dr. J.J. Levine with today's Mentorship Minute, and I look forward to sharing again with you real soon. Bye-bye, everybody.